Well, we had a, an a, an epidemic of lobsters in, in, in a biblical proportion, I guess is how you want to put it. And we've never seen anything like it. Well, I'm Willis Spear. I'm a commercial fisherman. I, I think it's been 47 years. I just, just goes to show you, when you think you know it all, you get humbled, you know? So. Usually on a regular day in July, boats might come in a thousand pounds. It's a really good catch a day. There are boats coming in with 6,500 pounds of lobster before 3 o'clock in the afternoon. My name is Brendan Reddy. I'm the co-owner of Reddy Seafood here in Portland, Maine, a live lobster distribution facility. Every day when lobstermen went and hauled their traps, there were more and more lobsters, and the market wasn't ready for that amount of soft lobsters to be sold. That caused you know, a lot of challenges, a lot of headaches, and that caused a, a, de a severe decrease in price. It seemed like we were catching all, all, all of them at once. And, well, the market reacted as we figured it would. It dropped by quarters. I mean, it was dropping a quarter a day. Now it's the lowest we've seen it in 30 years, and it, it, the price has not budged. If it doesn't come up soon, it's going to be a long winter. The last thing we ever are going to do is tell the fishermen, no, we can't buy your lobsters. We were lobstermen growing up, and we never want somebody to say, we don't want your product. What lobstermen are, are scared of is, hey, when supply in August or July is a little bit less, we don't want to get paid $2.25 or $2.50 a pound. You have to see an increase in price to the fishermen to support and make it stable for them. How it pans out in the end, I, I, I don't know. Here where I, I, I live, our, our catch has dropped off uh, the last two weeks, and yet we haven't seen a price to reflect the, the decline in the catch. The extra supply has forced everybody to work a little bit harder, but that's any business. It's changed. you you got to be ready for it. you got to be ready to adapt. You can see it just walking around town. If you go to any of the lobster restaurants, you'll see they're cranking. Business is extremely busy. The thought of too many lobsters, I mean, yeah, the market's plucked. We have to increase the demand. And hopefully, if the price goes up, it will trickle back down to the harvest of it. We need it.